Hey you guys, welcome back to another video and I want to officially introduce myself in today's video. I don't recall introducing myself but I try to share a little bit about myself with you in each video. As you have already figured it out, Wendy's world is run by Wendy. Yay. I I'm a blogger. I've been blogging for over eight years on and off the past few years because I've been so caught up with work and family and adjusting to a new living environment. And it's just been a whole life change for me. So I haven't had much time to be consistently tending to my blog. When this world it's an online space where you guys get to get a front row seat on the journey of the story of my life. My life choices may not always be the most desirable or yield desired results because I'm far from perfect. However, I do consider myself to be royalty and I'm a diamond in the rock. When this world is also an outlet of expression where I get to share information, popular views, various topics, making suggestions in an awe-inspiring, loving, fun way. It is also a two-way exchange of communication as I encourage constructive feedback, suggestions, thoughts, or any concerns that you might have. I'm open to your suggestions. When this world is also a medium used to encourage change. I'm all about change. I have no idea if it's because of my astrological sign. I'm a water sign and I'm a constant changing, evolving creature in nature. That's how I consider myself. So I believe that if you're not evolving, then you are dying. In order to grow, we must evolve and vice versa. The ability to adapt to change might not be an easy task or an innate ability, but living in our ever-changing world, we must feel inclined to be proactive and take action at all times. Look at what we're in experiencing at this time with this pandemic and all the changes occurring it's either you keep up or you get left behind i also believe that there are no handouts unless you have tons of generational wealth being inherited by your family or family bloodline instead many of us are battling generational curses which is the source of all our dysfunction and toxic behaviors we live in a changing and evolving environment and we must change and evolve in a spiritual mental emotional and financial level if possible i believe that embracing ourselves our imperfect selves identifying and cultivating our hidden gifts and talents is the first step there also has to be a willingness to love every bit of ourselves the good the bad and the ugly it's actually liberating to be a source of inspiration motivating others to be their best selves it's so joyful watching everyone do the work and emerge from their cocoon like an exquisite butterfly cheers y'all to win this world